Hi everyone, we're going to evaluate the definite integral um, over the interval 0 to pi over 2 for this given um, function. And we're going to use u substitution. And I'm going to use the standard u substitution for, um, on this one I'm going to use u equals cosine of x and du therefore is negative sine x dx. So in order to do that, I'm going to split this up and write sine is sine, sine to the fifth is sine to the fourth times sine of x dx. The reason I did that is I want this part so I can use my du there. So now, uh, since I'm doing that, I'm going to let this be... Um, Let's, let's rewrite this one more time. So for sine to the fourth, I'm going to write that as 1 minus cosine squared of x squared sine x dx. All right, now using our u substitution, so I'm going to write it like that, you're going to get over the interval from, and we have... Um, when you just first write it, you're going to get 0 to 1. Because what we're doing is uh, cosine of pi divided by 2 equals 0. And cosine of 0 equals 1. So I'm changing uh, my interval notation here. So now I can write this as 1 minus u squared negative du. All right. And then what you can do is, um, let's rearrange all of this. So we're going to get this equals, we're going to go back from 0 to 1. And when you multiply, um, what we had before was this. I'm going to pull this negative out and put it in front, and that's going to give you u squared um, minus 1 du. And then I'm going to uh, change that. So, oh, and we have the square there. So when you do that, then let's go ahead and uh, fix this up, and that's going to be 1 minus uh, 2u squared plus 4, it's just u to the 4th du. Now, integrating that, you're going to get, for this one, you get u minus 2u, and we could put a 3 here, so put 3, remember you're adding 1, and this is going to be plus 1 fifth u to the 5th, and then we're evaluating from 0 to 1. So now let's plug in our 1. That's going to give you 1 minus 2 thirds plus 1 fifth minus, you plug in 0, and you get a big 0 there. And that simplifies to uh, 15. If you have your common denominator as 15, that will be 15 minus 10 plus 3. And that equals 8 divided by 15. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.